What are you doing? There's no time to get on the slide. Come on. I thought you wanted to fight me. <laughs> okay. See, they will get one swing in. All right, survivors, welcome back to Unturned Hard Mode on the new Germany map. We're picking up just about where we left off, although I did uh, spend the whole night here listening to the wolves howl in the woods and the bears snuffling around. But uh, I was safe here by my fire, that's for sure. So, uh, time to go. Let's get rolling. We don't have all day. We got You got to use this daylight while it lasts, right? And I didn't want to do anything on camera in the dark because you guys can't see anything since I don't have any lighting. And check it out. The veggies are in. Yay, a tomato and a lettuce. Let's eat them up. Now I... Oops, hold on. So I did do a little work through the night. I chopped down three trees. I got some wood here and some spikes. I'm going to try to get creative with these spikes to kill zombies since they're uh, pretty tough to kill on hard mode since you can't stun them. But if we can set up some spikes around, cause a little damage, and we can beat them up with our fisty cuffs or a saw, etc. So down to 34% with that saw after chopping down those trees. But the good news is we had some experience, and we got a little bit left here, actually. Oh, you know what? Let's bump up stealth one more, and can we get exercise? No! Dang it, we gotta kill one zombie. We can do that. Number one rule of the zombie apocalypse. Anybody know? Cardio. Well, according to Zombie Land, the movie, it's cardio. <laughs> oh, I don't get anything from, I don't get experience from that guy, but I do get his, uh, his crossbow. That's pretty awesome. Uh, yeah, so Zombie Land, great movie, by the way. Woody Harrelson, uh, Bill Murray's in it. Wham! Come here, come here, dude. Oh, oh. the windows are so small. Uh, yeah, it's a great movie, and uh, one of the main characters has this, he has all these rules. He has to live by to survive the zombie apocalypse. And the number one rule, cardio. But in unturned, cardio is regeneration of your um, stamina bar. That's not really the number one. I would say exercise is more important than that one. Because the idea is you have to outrun the zombies, right? You've got to be faster than the zombies, and the slow ones go first. You don't have to be the fastest, but you have to be faster than the slowest guy. <laughs> All right, there's some blueberries. Let's eat them up also known as indigo. These over here, by the way, are not russet. I thought they were russet. I identified them at first sight yesterday as russet, but they're actually amber. And we're not gonna eat those right now because they do lower your um, your toxicity. And we're at 78% right now. I think it drops at about five or 10% when you eat them. So these are kind of like emergency food only. So we don't need them right now. So we're gonna leave them right there. Can I pick these up? I can pick up the ones that weren't damaged. Uh. Yeah, I thought we got at least a stick back. No, we didn't get anything back. Okay, well, that's all right. We got three more spikes if we need them. Now, what we're mostly interested here in here is the uh, oh, here's a dude, a couple of dudes. Is that car right there, right? So hopefully it's got battery and gas and yoo hoo. You know what? We have a crossbow now. <laughs> let's get this guy out here. This won't kill him, but here, let's call him out. Hey, dude. All right, we're not gonna we're not gonna do that. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna shoot him in the back of the head, and then we're gonna bang him with our that uh, saw. Oh, 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 oh! It's a blue camo pitchfork. <laughs> that looks sweet. Oh gosh! All right, this guy we're gonna have him go through the spikes. Come on, fella. Wham! Oh, oh, oh no! Are you kidding me? What? That didn't kill him? I figure with the spikes and one shot to the face with uh, with the pitchfork would have killed him, but it didn't. Oh, that's too bad. Because now we're down to 35%. Eh. Alright. All this fooling around. Alright, you know what? Then let's not fool around. Let's put this back in the hand. Reload. And I think... I guess now we should check out this... Um, farmhouse but first of all let's see if this has all the tires it does four tires and a battery sweet uh can we pull this up a little bit without being spotted yeah yes my sneaky beaky apparently extends to vehicles <laughs> red flare and here's a shirt uh we can tear that up grab it but don't tear it up when the zombie's about because they can hear you that's a seed isn't it can't believe we couldn't kill that guy with a pitchfork with a couple of shots. 
Good, a Nugan. All right, well, if that's how it's going to be, shoot this guy. <laughs> ah! All right, I thought that would kill him, but... <laughs> and a flanky. How far are you going to chase me? What's that up top there? All right, I see some more items of cloth. So let's go grab those, and we can heal up a little bit. Grab my arrow back. This is the way we should do it. Unfortunately, in hard mode, you, uh, you do have to be a little more sneaky than a normal. This guy we should be able to kill with one shot to the head. If I can get a headshot. On. Yeah. Oh, <gasps> chainsaw. Oh, baby. Oh, the ultimate weapon. Although, um, it's not going to stun in hard mode. Because they can put him in a, a stun lock in normal mode. Right? But not in hard mode. So I'm still going to rely on that thing, on this thing, to kill. Without getting too close. Oh, he, he pooped! Shot the poop out of him, huh? Alright. Oh, I'm going to wear one, the red one. Uh, no, let's put the white one on. It's in better shape. Strip that one down and always have a rag, right? you got to always have at least one rag to stop bleeding. And, well, we'll have two rags now. Okay. Ooh. Somebody heard something. They heard me ripping stuff up. And he's coming up. I'm gonna ambush him. <gasps> oh gosh. Oh gosh, they heard that. Chainsaws now make noise. In case you didn't know. Oh boy. Uh, this is like leg breaking. Whoa! Nope. Okay, didn't break the leg. Oh, I thought so. I thought we were done for. Okay, now it's time to go. Goodbye, farm. Goodbye, farmers. Have fun brewing your beers. Look at us with a hat on. That's great. I didn't know I had it. picked up a hat somewhere. <laughs> All right. Well, I've been in better shape before, but you know what? We're, we're alive. 35% health. 72 toxicity. We got a little car here with a little bit of gas. And, oh, hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop. What is that? Is this a dead zone? Are you kidding me? Wow. Dead zone right here. Yeah, you can see those trees. Let's reload. Yep, those trees. All the leaves are gone. Dead zone. All right, we definitely don't want to go in the dead zone. We'll die so fast. I, no. Oh, sun's going up. I was going to say, the sun's already going down. All right, well, we're going to take a right here and then avoid this dead zone for now. But that's good to know. When we get a uh, gas mask and so forth, we can go that way. It's probably good loot. Okay, well, I don't know where we are. Oh, here's a uh, roadblock telling people there's a uh, dead zone up ahead. That's pretty neat. I don't know where we are because I've never been on this map before. Oh, wait a minute. Something up ahead. And I don't have a... Uh, we don't have a chart or a GPS yet, so I'm hoping to find one. Maybe we'll get one in this little town. Looks like a little sleepy little town. Oh, here's a sign here, too. Warning sign. 4% gas here, guys. All right. Uh... We're gonna, we are going to set up a little camp right here. Grab my campfire. See this in the night. Nice flat area. This is nice. And is that the only seed I have? Yeah. We got 27 experience to spend. And I think I'm going to go with overkill. That'll do more damage with melee weapons, right? That's important. 17 left. How about if we dump some into... Virus endurance is actually really good. Uh, very important in hard mode especially but you gotta go with the exercise move speed etc all right that's five percent growth and now let's head into town and let's go say hey to the diamonds now keep in mind zombies do spawn inside buildings unlike in the new brunswick map my last hard playthrough oh this rope right there didn't even see it blended right in with that maple table Good thing. Oh, chemicals, chemicals, chemicals are good because we can make a vaccine, I think, right? Yeah, chemicals, uh, glue, bricks, and I think a can, and we can make a vaccine. Get rid of some of this uh, toxic stuff swimming around in our bloodstream. Um, a hammer. A hammer? A hammer. And a candy bar. Whoa, and a zombie. Don't run too fast. There's something on that chair. We'll come back for it. Saw it. Oh, gosh. Okay. We're being chased. 
Oh, oh boy. Uh, spikes! Spikes, <clears throat> put them in the road. Oh. <laughs> oh no! Walked right through it. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We got it. We got this. Down to 35%. I can't really mess around too much here. Boom! What? <laughs> Can we kill that guy with one shot? One shot in the back of the head. That's awesome. Maybe because it's from behind and they're surprised, you get a little bonus attack damage or something. I forget exactly how that works. That could be it. Now, hold on. There was something on this couch. Another hammer. So now we can fix some things up. And I don't think I can fix the crossbow without a blowtorch. I cannot. I can fix this and that. Uh, or we can hang on to the metal and not fix anything. And we can make a rifle eventually. That could be good. We can make a, a makeshift rifle, right? Look at this. we got a, a water tower here, which is fantastic. Except that I have no way to get the water out of it. Uh, all right. Well, um, we got a church, a botanist, a cafe, some kind of uh, diner here. I'd like to find a gas station. All right, we're at the far end over this side. Oh, there's a little car there, but it looks like it's missing some tires. But maybe we can grab a battery out of it. Uh, oh, is that one of the new Volkswagens? Oh, there's a bus down there too, guys. Oh, party bus. That'd be fun. I think we're going to sneak in the diner here and see what we got. Uh, oh, that guy. There's a chef in the back, too. This could be dangerous. All right, we're going to draw this dude out. We're going to draw you out. Ah, he's out. He's out. And here he comes. Yeah, let's try to get a headshot on him. And then a little Zaparuski with the old chainsaw. Whew, all the way to the end of the road. <laughs> oh, it's a dead end here. By a river. Well, this is nice. We're going to make a base this season. Unlike in the last two seasons of hard mode, we said we weren't going to build a base. We're just going to kind of uh, be nomads. But I think we'll do a base here. And really spend a lot of time in Germany kind of looking around. Because um, I haven't seen it before, obviously. And it would be fun. And we need a lot of time to see all the sights in Germany. Can I shoot this guy in the back of the head? If I get around from behind, I bet I can. Oh! Boat docks! Oh, 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 oh. Is there a boat in the water right there? Oh, yeah! It's a runabout. I think that's a runabout right there. All right, let's go shoot this guy up. And we're going to have to make up some bandages. 35% is really low. Got him. Check the kayak. Sometimes you find stuff in the kayaks. Not this time. Oh, we dropped a hammer. Oh, look at all this. Eggs, granola bar. Okay. Granola bar is good. How's that cheese? I'm not going to grab the cheese. I know we can make, like make grilled cheese and stuff you can cook with the eggs and the cheese but it's gonna be a while before we get to that point what is this note I could swear I went camping last week in Bielefeld I must be losing my mind I'm going to see a counselor yeah so apparently that's some kind of a meme Be Bielefeld is that how you say that I didn't know that like the first meme ever the place doesn't exist or something so I get it I get it uh, all right, I'm gonna keep on trucking here now. We never did check out the diner did we? we drew the zombie out But we never went inside and there is a chef on the other side, so we gotta watch out for him Grape juice 20% well if we get putrefication tablets We can putrefy that and everything will be hunky-dory. So I'll bring it Lettuce will turn into a seed, but not right now that chef will hear it. He'll be like who's tearing up my lettuce into a seed And He'll come and investigate and Then we'll have a fight on our hands it's a phone. Oh, we got a fight on our hands anyway, apparently. All right, draw him out. Draw him out. And thank you for your experience. Whew. Yeah. The no stun thing is super scary. Because you don't know how many hits it's going to take to kill the guy. And if he gets one swing at you, it's going to do some damage. going to drop your toxicity level. Might even make you bleed. In hard mode, all the zombies can make you bleed, not just the crawlies. Oh, ah, oh, yucky. What's up with this juice? 
It's all so bad. All right, I'm going to keep moving here. There's a botanist over there. We can go check for seeds and uh, and fert. fertilizer. Duct tape would be nice. Or if we find glue, we can actually make some duct tape. And then we can think about maybe making that, um, making that pine rifle. Anything in the fridges? Yes. Dang. It's a Coca-Cola, but can't drink that. I can, but it's not going to feel good in my stomach. All right, this little crawly dude. Oh, two little crawlies. That's like almost free experience. Still a risk. Oh, there's maple syrup. <laughs> we got to take these guys down. Let's draw them out. Hey. Come on, dum-dum. I don't want to fight indoors here. Too many bad things can happen. Too many bad things. Let's bring them outside, out back. Come on. Come on out back and say that to me, huh? Eh? It's a different story out here, isn't it? All right, let's get the spikes going, actually. Oh, man. He's faster than he looks. That ought to do it. Come on, fella. Oh, that hurts, doesn't it? Sheesh. <laughs> man, that takes forever. I'm going to draw the other guy out right to the same spot if we can. And I know this is slow going. It's very methodical. Um, obviously, I have to be a little more cautious in hard mode because you can't stun them. So this is what you have to do. Please tell me that's drinkable. It is not. Ugh. That's what you get. Who's stocking these shelves around here anyway? Putting all this junk up here. Hmm? Everything's expired. Come on. Don't give me those excuses now. <laughs> We're almost there. Follow me to the spikes. They won't hurt much. And then I can stab you in the face. All right. Come on. Right over here, fella. Not too far now. You can do it. You can do it. I have faith. Just don't die on them. I'm over here. <laughs> Wham! Jeez. These guys are tough. They are tough. Let me tell you. All right. Now, let's uh, ooh, check the skills here. Uh, I'm going to hold off. I'm going to hold off on the skills just yet. I want to analyze them a little bit more. Oh, there's a runner over there, but we can take him out with one shot with this. Ooh, take me to church. What can we find in a church during the zombie apocalypse? Maybe the Bible. That'd be nice. Say a few prayers. Whoa! Oh, hello, Mr. Flanker. This could be tough. Where'd he go? Where is he? I don't see him. Oh, here he is. Here he is. Come on. No, 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 no. Don't be so dumb. Do the spikes. Yes! <laughs> cardio, people! Cardio! Uh-oh. Somebody else is coming now. Oh, gosh! Alright, I gotta... Oh, I missed him. Oh, this is getting scary now. This is, this, now this is scary. Alright, let's go get... Let's get out of here. Let's get up into the woods. And see if I can find my arrow, because I shot it straight up toward the hill. I still don't have the cardio to mess around with these guys like this. We're not quite at that point. And there goes my one arrow. Oh, that was foolish. Yep. Yep. It sure were. It sure were. Alright, let's see if we can get them to go through the spikes one more time. Yeah, this is what it takes. This is what it takes. At least we cleared the park, almost. Let me put down some more spikes. Let's get rid of these guys. Here comes the flanker. And we know his hurt already. Got him. Oh, good. Binox. Huh? I need those Binox. Need the Binox. There we go. Good boy. Good boy. No touch. And flashlight. Oh, I needed that too. <laughs> Two of the things I was hoping for today. What are you doing? There's no time to get on the slide. Come on. I thought you wanted to fight me. Okay. <laughs> See, they will get one swing in. Can't kill them fast enough with this thing. Uh, I should probably put some points into medical. So I can get better healing. It's going to be important. I'm going to bang that up twice, actually, before we do a heal. I really should. 35%. This is this is risky, running around with 35%. Let me tell you. I think I can wreck you. Yeah, that'll do. 
it. Uh, 76%. Goes down fast, doesn't it? Oh, there's a dude in there. But it looks like... Is that salty chips, sir? You got the salty chips. I don't want salty chips. Let's go over here. Oh. I gotta get rid of this guy. I just gotta get rid of him. I wanna get into that botanist shop. <laughs> All right, good. A little, a little, a flaky, flanky in there too. What is that over there? Some big pavilion. Okay, this is important. This is super important. All right. I don't see any. Oh, look at them all. <laughs> I didn't see any fertilizer in there, but we have rope. We can make fertilizer. Now, what is this over here? So big, colorful uh, pavilion. Oh gosh, down almost down to seven percent. Okay, let's go plant these seeds. Um, and then we'll head over to that pavilion. Alright, guys. We're just going to drink my milk. There we go from old Bessie in the last episode. There we go. Up to 63%. That's fantastic. Let's eat this granola bar. And now we just have to wait for our veggies to grow. Because that's all we got. But maybe there's something over here at this, uh, this pavilion. So this is this like a um, like Oktoberfest or something? I mean, everything's kind of brownish, so maybe it is fall. Maybe it's October. Cause this looks pretty awesome. I see a huge beer cake. Oh, look at this! There's bottles on the ground. Oh, that's great. Too bad I can't pick one up and have some. Oh, <gasps> duct tape! Duct tape! We got the duct tape, but we also have a zombie and some glue. Hey, come here. Oh, look, he's got the little German suit on. Little St. Pauli girl. Okay, that did pretty good. That, that killed him pretty quickly. As long as I can backpedal fast enough, we should be in good shape with this thing. Just gotta keep it uh, 100%. Oh, check out the tap! Too bad I can't turn it on and put my head under it. And have a nice big gulp. Man, must have been a huge party here recently. And then the zombies struck... Crash the party. What a shame. What an absolute shame. Alright. Oh, there's a bus, guys. We have not been in this side of the town yet. Let's, uh... Oh, there's a cemetery. Let's go inside this house. I could really use uh, some more cloth. Um, there's somebody in here, I think. Hold on. <gasps> oh, oh, jeez. <gasps> She heard me, he heard me, it heard me. Come on out here. Ooh, just enough. Oh, rope, perfect, dude. Thank you, we can use that to make fertilizer and then save the other rope for a, uh, a rifle, which we can make. We can make a pine rifle now. Pretty sure we got everything we need. But let's just check these cabinets. A little bit of food. Some more glue is always nice. Ooh, binoculars for a makeshift scope. Okay, now we're doing fine here. Yeah, Germany's panning out. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> All right, so let's just check out one more house, I guess. Uh, what is this right there? I see rope. Oh, a rake and rope. Okay, and a knife that's metal. Good, good, good. All right, the apocalypse elves are actually doing good things for us right now. Nothing in the garage. Um, I still don't have pants. Does anybody in Germany wear pants? I can't believe this. I have tons of shirts and sweater vests, but no, no pants. All right. Well, must have been a good party then. Everybody kept their pants on. No, wait. No, that's wrong. It's not a good party if you keep your pants on. And what is this right here? Is this a pharmacy? Some kind of a post office. Oh, wow, it's full, but there's some goodies in there, too. Oh, man, I really need a ranged weapon. Yeah, here's what we're going to do. Let's make one. Let's go make a ranged weapon. Man, we'll shoot those fools. Four planks and crafting one. Okay, what's crafting one cost? 20! Yes, we can do it. All right, great. So, uh, and we need four planks. And I have a saw, thankfully. So we can make planks easy peasy. Kept a lot of wood just for that reason. Since I can't find one, we're just gonna have to make one. It's kind of a waste of materials, but it's gotta be done. Oh, there it is. Isn't she a beaut? 
just whipped her up. Uh, crossbow. I'm probably just going to scrap the crossbow at this point. Oh, it doesn't even come with full clip. <laughs> Only four out of five rounds. And I don't have duct tape. Oh, we can make duct. We can make duct tape. We can make tape. I was going to say we can make a uh, scope with this right now. All right. Well, we're going to make the tape, and then we're going to make a uh, makeshift scope. And we're going to toss that on there. We got four extremely loud rounds. But this does good damage. It's really good damage. So we should be able to take out three zombies with it. And do we have any more spikes? Let's make up some more spikes. All right, we got two sets of spikes here. And we're going to stand behind the spikes. And we're going to shoot these fools. Headshot. Oh gosh, where'd he come from? Alright, well it kills that guy with one shot, but not these other enemies, and I think I missed one too. Oh, maybe I did get him. That's a nice shot. Oh! Man, he was a tough guy. He almost got us. I think that's all of them. Did you guys drop anything? Nobody dropped any pants. A rake? What am I gonna do with your rake? I'm gonna get rid of this. For the metal. That's a lot of metal too, which is very nice. And we can make a lot of uh we can make bullets for a pine rifle. Okay, these are hundred percent. Did that guy from the store come out? Yes, he did. Okay. And you didn't have anything on you, huh? Alright, let's make uh Wow, it's down to eighty four percent already? Was it one hundred percent when I made it? Because that drops fast. But now we can get into the post office, we grab some rope. And some more rope here. And is that it? I was hoping for some more duct tape. Okay. Well, not sure if that was worth it, but... Sure is fun shooting that rifle. I love the sound of that thing. It sounds so powerful. But now it's empty. And how much does it cost to make... Six metal? You guess. Alright, well, let's just do it. Gotta have, gotta have the rounds. And look at this bus. Let's take a bus uh, back to camp. Whatever, we're going for it. We're going for it. This thing is a monstrosity. Oh man, it does not turn easily. <laughs> Why is it going so slow? And it's and it's turning to the left for some reason. It's literally like just it just wants to go left. I don't know why. That is a dead end. Oh boy. This thing does not turn. Oh, can I get around that? Yes. Okay. Nope. Sorry, we're not taking any fare today. No passengers today. This bus needs... Oh, that's why it's going to the left. It's missing a tire. And it's actually still driving. How is that possible? I didn't know you could drive vehicles with missing tires. I just thought they wouldn't go at all. But this one's missing a tire. I'm wondering why it's pulling to the left. Well, that explains it. This thing's good on gas, too. You know, I wish we could do pull tires off other vehicles with, like, a crowbar. That would be amazing. All right, guys. We're going to call it quits right here, right now. And we'll pick up next time. And hopefully we can get healed up a little bit. We were down to 35% most of the day today, weren't we? But we pulled through. All right. Looking pretty good. So hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and we'll see you. Uh, we'll see you in the next uh, episode in the morning. I'm just gonna kind of work through the night here, and get organized, and then we'll uh, roll out and see some more sights in Germany. <laughs> All right, have a good one. Bye bye.